And we're going to take a quick break now, but before we do, here's one America's Bree Teeley with a quick look at your three-day weather forecast. Bree. Well, thank you. Let us take a look at our weather map here. You can see the radar covering parts of the country. Now, the green part that you see here is rain. The teal part is snow, but I'm sure you could have figured that out. Up in the northwest, you can see uh, moisture is making a return. An upper ridge is beginning to break down, which will allow for an approaching Pacific front to move onshore over the next few days. Washington, Oregon, and parts of Northern California all set to see rain. The Washington Cascades and Northern Rockies will see some snow, but the big story right now is this cold front that you see moving across the south, which is actually a rare winter storm making its way towards the deep south and southeast. A mix of snow, freezing rain, and sleet is expected to hit the northern fringe, with portions of the Gulf Coast seeing winter like conditions by tomorrow evening. And finally, freezing cold temperatures remain in the northeast after a storm swept through there today. The combination of falling temperatures and gusty winds makes for bitter conditions. Well, let's take a quick look at highs and lows. You can see Chicago bitterly cold today, a high of negative three, a low of negative 12. Honolulu, Hawaii saw some rain with a high of 74, a low of 66. Dallas also quite chilly, a high of 38, a low of 23 in New York. High of 40 today, low of 11. You can see that temperatures drop tomorrow and Wednesday as the storm moves through. Seattle uh, saw a high today of 48, a low of 41. They will see rain tomorrow through Wednesday. And Phoenix looking warm, warm, warm. Well, that is your latest weather for this hour. We're going to take a quick break, but be sure to stay with us for more of today's top headlines here on One America News.